Hello, I'm Ariris. Today, I'm going to talk about Detective Conan. The manga, which started in January 1994, still continues. Like me, many readers are wondering about the ending. Kudo Shinichi, the protagonist of the manga, is made to drink poison in its early chapters. He is rejuvenated as a result of this poison. Do you think Shinichi will be able to revert to his previous state? I think yes, it's a shounen manga after all. Since Shinichi is the main character, I believe he achieves his goals. So, how will Shinichi's antidote be created so that he can return to his regular state? Is it going to be produced or not? According to Agasa, in order to develop an antidote to a poison, must first know the poison. This reveals that knowledge of the production of apotoxin 4869 is needed in order to develop an antidote. An antidote cannot be developed unless it is known why apotoxin rejuvenates people. In other words, once an antidote for apotoxin 4869 is discovered, a medicine that rejuvenates humans will be possible. The antidotes that Shiho has developed so far allow them to return to their normal state for a short time. So, how will Shinichi return to his former self permanently? I believe the answer to this question is time. Conan's universe, as we all know, has yet to pass a year. Conan should be back to normal in around a year after taking the medicine, in my opinion. Similarly, I believe Mary and Shiho will be back to normal one year after taking the drug. Although Shinichi thinks this medication as poison, many other people may view it as a miracle. As a result, I don't believe Gosho Sensei would ever create an antidote. I think this way because Gosho Sensei said in an interview that he dreams of a happy ending for Shiho. To be honest, I doubt Shiho would be happy if she developed the antidote. As I said before, Shiho's knowledge is a miracle for many people. This information will be wanted by a lot of people.